Cortex is the productivity stack. This is the stack you want to take for total mental energy, total mental dominance, total motivation, verbal fluency, focus, and the drive to get work done. Get the Cortex Nootropic stack at livecortex.com. Feel what it feels like to fire on all cylinders. What's up, everybody? I am your Nootropics Information Wizard, Ryan Michael Ballard. Check us out on the web at livecortex.com, livecortex.com slash blog. Biggest blog on the planet for Nootropics Information on Facebook at facebook.com slash cortex stacks. And then we've got a podcast right episode number 47 just launched the super nootropic of alpha lipoic acid and red wine uh, at the Cortex Labs Nootropics podcast. Thanks so much for listening. We're going to talk about artichoke extract and forskolin. Uh, what I think of the combination and uh, you know, kind of what I think you, should, you, you could stack artichoke extract with uh, based on you know, my experience with that combination. Okay, so we're gonna talk about it in just a sec. We'll talk about the Silstep stack a bit. We'll talk about why I truly think that stack resonates with folks uh, and it is not the artichoke extract in Force Glenn in my opinion. Okay, so we'll get to that in just a sec. Let's do 40 seconds of product pro. Number one, the Cortex stack. Uh, the Cortex stack is a uh, powerful primate stack. I mean, if you wanna be able to just take a couple capsules and turn the, the lights on, get into one, one mode, go mode, like go gear. Uh, get a bottle of the Cortex stack. It's our nootropic stack. I was taking it to run a company nearly 18 hours a day <laughs> and give myself exceptional brain performance and then formulated it in a premium stack because all of my entrepreneur friends were like, dude, this this shit is like modafinil, so you must put this out. All my entrepreneur friends pressured me like, you have a good product here. Uh, get that at livecortex.com. We've got three digital guides that teach you how to use nootropics, but mostly they're digital stack lists. One on Nupept, one on Racetams, and one that's basically has everything sort of encompassed all in one. Then we've got a nootropics consulting service. It's a 40 minute call with yours truly, 15 additional email correspondence. We can help you shave stuff off your stack, formulate a stack for you, answer questions about nootropics, anything you want, get all that stuff at livecortex.com. Okay, so let's just give you some background about what the artichoke extract for Skin thing is. Some time ago, uh, you know, I guess I was, I might've been three or four years into taking nootropics. It, 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 there's this, there was a stack that came on the scene uh, that seemed to be relatively popular or at least at least there was some discussion around it. And the discussion seemed to stem from uh, a uh, from an entrepreneur called Tim Ferriss. Tim Ferriss, I'm sure some of you know who Tim Ferriss is, wrote a bunch of books, uh, pretty smart dude. So he discussed where you could combine, you know, uh, four to 500 milligrams of artichoke extract with low dose forskolin. We're talking about five to 18 or 20 milligrams. And you'd get like a modafinil like effect. And so what, what then happened thereafter is a bunch of people started experimenting with it, uh, f you know, with mixed results as usual. I mean, that really doesn't tell us a whole lot. Um, but then a company called Natural Stacks built a product with it in it called Siltep. Um, and, uh, and that was sort of the bottom line. The mechanism, you know, that is postulated there is that uh, artichoke extract and forskolin are inhibiting this thing called PDE4. And by inhibiting PDE4, you're producing more energy. You know, you're basically, to make it, to put it simple, you're forcing the brain to produce more energy. And so, uh, so as a result, you get mental clarity, focus, you know, motivation, all the, the normal things that, you know, a good solid brain uh, would have. Um, that's sort of my take on it. Let me, let me just, and that's the mechanism. I don't know if that's right or not. Uh, I, I gotta say, I, I don't really know. I've researched it and it seems plausible, uh, and, uh, but I cannot confirm or deny whether or not I, th I think that's right. That might be for somebody who is in, uh, I don't know, molecular biology. Like that really truly might be for somebody that, that goes even beyond the scope of my understanding of, of those mechanisms particularly. Uh, but so uh, my experience with just artichoke extract and forskolin and roughly four to 500 milligrams of artichoke extract, five to 20 milligrams of forskolin is that I can actually induce a pretty good nootropic state from it, but it does not last long, 20, 30 minutes, and it's sort of shifty. 10 minutes, it'll feel relatively good. Then I'll kind of feel a little funky and mildly brain fog, and then I'll sort of jump back into play. Then after 30 or so minutes, it kind of just goes away. Whereas compared to even the short-lived racetams like aniracetam, or oxyrastam, they at, at the very least last one to two hours uh, and sometimes sort of residual effects in the ensuing hours, so three hours like total. And so I could really never get it to give me a sustainable, strong brain performance effect, but during that 30 minute period, I actually got it to perform relatively well. I just couldn't apply that to any tasks because it was shifty and it, I, it wasn't you know, long term. Now, I, I'm perfectly you know, willing to acknowledge that I'm one person and you know brains are different. so. 
who knows uh, you know how it affects other people. Uh, some folks do report that just artichoke extract and just forskolin affects their brain positively. Uh, what I would say about the Siltep stack, though, is that uh, I do not, I, I've tried the Siltep stack, and I know many people who tried it. We, we have a large sample size of folks that we discuss the nootropics information with, and I can ask on them and sort of draw on them in any moment to answer questions to try sample stacks of what we're bringing out and everything else in between. And, uh, you know, what I would say about why people respond well to the Siltep stack, this seems very clear to me. The, the, the reason is because uh, more so phenylalanine and alcar together, uh, I would say, more so than artichoke extract and forskolin together. Now, there, there could be the potential for artichoke extract, forskolin, phenylalanine, and alcar to stack very well together, and that can amplify the effects you know, of, of each of those sort of uh, constituents, but it is more than likely the donation of acetylcholine A from alcar to the production of acetylcholine, as well as the, the shuttling of fatty acids as a fuel substrate to mitochondria of brain cells, another, uh, you know, another you know, demonstrable trait of alcar, and then also the production of dopamine via the phenylalanine, which is essentially a precursor to dopamine. And so the combination of those two, I've experimented with separately too, and that, that's very stimulatory. That's very inducive of mental energy focus, these sorts of things. For me, even verbal fluencies, I respond very well to Alcar. Always have. It's one of my favorite nootropic compounds. It's one of the best nootropics there are out there. So yeah, the Siltip stack has one of the best nootropics in the world, in my opinion, and that's Alcar in it. Uh, and then combine with phenylalanine. That's really where I think folks get the best effects. That's my take on Siltep and, and artichoke extract and forskolin as a combination. What I've really come to learn though is that the real utility of artichoke extract, not forskolin, but just artichoke extract, is to actually low dose it with other nootropic compounds that work on increasing mental energy. So lower dosing, uh, and by lower dosing, I mean 100 or so milligrams artichoke extract with theocrine is like extremely powerful. So something like 225 to 100 milligrams of theocrine, insanely powerful combination, okay? Uh, but the real beneficial you know, combination of artichoke extract and any other nootropic, and for those of you that are like, think like this is just a plug for Cortex, I don't care what you think, this is what I came to find, is that you, if you stack low dose artichoke extract with uridine monophosphate, and either CDP choline or alpha GPC in roughly the following doses, 100 milligrams artichoke extract, 150 milligrams of uridine monophosphate, and 80 to 100 milligrams of either CDP choline or alpha GPC, that then you could actually get a modafinil-like effect with you know, natural compounds. That's what I found, that you could turn on brain energy and really uh, put the brain in a place where you have an insatiable desire to get work done. It's like you're working on some some mechanisms that really turn brain on. Now, whether this is the combination of of the uh, of mildly inhibiting PDE4, uh, we know that artichoke extract stimulates bile production in the gallbladder and release. So perhaps it's helping the absorption of the uridine and the CDP choline. I don't know, I mean, I'm just really postulating at this point, but perhaps there's some other energy production mechanisms that are working in conjunction with the dopamine receptor modulation happening from CDP choline, right? The dopamine receptor modulation happening from uridine monophosphate, the neurite outgrowth facilitation happening from, uh, from uridine monophosphate, uh, the, uh, essentially the spawning of new neurons, the, 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 at, at the very least the facilitation of neurogenesis happening from both uridine and CDP choline. Together they are neurogenic. You combine them with a B vitamin DHA and they're unquestionably neurogenic and so that's probably what we're looking at on, on why a stack of artichoke extract, uridine, and CDP choline is very strong for a lot of folks that respond well to it. Um, and that, that's the basis for the Cortex nootropic stack. I figured that out, not because I wanted to build a pre-made stack, I actually didn't even care. Like I, I was just an entrepreneur who took nootropics, with no intention of building a pre-made stack. And I was taking that stack to run a company 18 hours a day, giving it to other entrepreneur friends of mine. And they were like, dude, you have to, you know, my entrepreneur friends are pr pressuring me, like, because that's what entrepreneurs do. You, you, you have to create a product with this combination. So we built Cortex. Uh, so that's basically my take on it. Um, do I think artichoke extract and forskolin is a good combination? Yeah, I actually got it to work for me, but it was very short-lived. 
Uh, I think if I were to continue to experiment and really research and really put some time into it, I could probably make it work better. Um, there are other people that take just artichoke extract and just forsquilin and do get good results. There is no question about that. So what, what are we to think about that? Like it works right there. Um, the strength of the, or the significance of the Siltep stack in my opinion, again, this is conjecture, but it's conjecture based on, it's not just a hypothesis, right? It's a theory based on things we know, uh, is that that is truly the acetyl coenzyme A production or donation to the acetylcholine production. It's the fatty acid uh, optimization or shuttling to brain cell mitochondria for fuel via the alcar. And it's the combination of the, of the two of those, the dopamine production via the phenylalanine that's really truly turning up the brain energy uh, in conjunction with the various B vitamins, which work in conjunction with both alcar and phenylalanine. So that's really what I think is stimulating people's brains when they're taking Siltep. Um, and then, you know, the real, the real benefit uh, the real utility of artichoke extract I've come to learn in nine years experimenting with nootropics is that you can low dose it with uridine and CDP choline and it works really well. You could also low dose it at 100 or so milligrams with 25 to 75 milligrams of triacetyl uridine. Uh, and then, you know, again, 80 to 100 milligrams of either CDP choline and alpha GPC. And it works remarkably, turns the brain on. It's, it's very significant. Uh, I found also that you could stack 100 milligrams of artichoke extract with a regular dose of nupept and a choline source. And you could also get similarly stimulatory benefits from it. Okay. So, you know, that's that the utility really is in low dosing the artichoke extract and then combining it with, you know, uridine, triacetyluridine, CDP choline, alpha GPC, or a nupept in the, you know, presentations I broke down. And that is my take on the artichoke extract for school and combination. Thanks for watching. All right, everybody. Thanks so much for watching the video. Thanks for being with me. Ryan Michael Bally here. Check it out. These four are our powerful nootropic products. So start from the top. You're going to want to hear this. Number one, the Cortex stack. That is our powerful pre-made stack. This is the stack you want to take if you want to get work done. Let me just be serious with you. I created that stack running a company 18 hours a day to get my brain to have massive verbal fluency, total motivation, right? total overall mental fluidity, lots of mental energy, lots of drive to work. I mean, entrepreneurs need brain performance. We created that stack for people that really, really need brain performance and ain't messing around. The Cortex stack, get it at livecortex.com. You will love that stack. Uh, those digital guides, we'll start from the Racetam God Guide. That guide is a digital stack list of some of the most highly effective brain state specific Racetam stacks on the planet. I mean, basically you're getting oxiracetam, paracetam, aniracetam, uh, phenylparacetam, coloracetam, fasoracetam, nefaracetam, pramaracetam, stacks, very powerful stacks of all those racetams laid out in that guide. The new Pet Pro Stack List is a giant list of sublingual oral and nasal NuPEP stacks. So we've